Good morning, ladies. I will never diet again. My name is Lori and welcome to my kitchen. Today, I'm going to teach you how to make black beans from scratch. So stay tuned. Black beans are really easy to make in your Instant Pot. We need three cups of dry black beans. Of course, you can make smaller batches if you want to. But lately, I have just been loving the black beans. We need to clean them because sometimes little rocks get in there. You don't want the little rocks in your beans. All right, we rinse them off and then drain them. Usually black beans are pretty clean. All right. Now we're just gonna we're gonna fill it up, probably a few inches above the line of the beans. One thing about the instant pot that's so nice is I don't have to pre-soak them. You can soak them overnight; they'll cook even faster. But this just makes it easier. Just have to plan ahead for at least for like an hour and fifteen minutes, and then we're good. Let's see. Yeah, it's below the halfway. It's below the halfway mark. I've noticed that black beans are easier for me to digest, and I don't like the the vapors <laughs> that beans can give me. Especially if I've eaten it for two or three days in a row, it can be very unpleasant. But I've recently discovered something, a secret that I'm going to share with you. All along, I've been adding garlic or a slice of onion per my Mexican friend, but it didn't really cover the cover, you know, taking away the gas. Or they say soak it overnight and dump out the water, that helps. But I've discovered an herb that helps even more. The herb is called episote. Episote is a pungent herb. It's kind of strong smelling. Kind of reminds me of wormwood, but not as strong. I don't know. It's just a different different kind of smell. And for this seems to take out the gas for me, so I've been pretty happy. So I just looked up a recipe. I use a couple of leaves, and it said to use two sprigs. So I'm going to try two sprigs and see if that's even better. I'm going to include my onion and my garlic just for flavor. I love the flavor with the onion and the garlic. I'm gonna rinse this off and put in the sprigs. And we, we only put in the leaves. So let's put the leaves in. I think I'm just gonna do one, this here, cause that's a lot. I haven't used this much before. And now we're gonna put it in the Instant Pot. Instant Pot, close my little daily dally. Plug it in. And because they're, they aren't soaked, I'm setting this on high. Whoops, well first pressure cook. High, not keeping it warm. And then I'm going to do this for about an hour and five minutes. And now I wait because I want those yummy bean tacos for breakfast. I do not recommend quick release on the beans. They're much softer when they're not. Also make sure that they're soft, otherwise they will be gassy. Remove the episote and now you have yummy, 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 fresh, 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 soft black beans or any beans of your choice. If they're bigger, you're probably needing to cook them longer, maybe five or 10 minutes longer. Like and subscribe, please.